Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. The Indian Navy has planned to build 16 anti-submarine warfare shallow watercraft. The Cochin Shipyard and GRSC had signed the contract for construction and supply of these warships in April 2019 with each shipbuilders constructing 8 of these ships. At present, CSL is constructing 3 warships and GREC has already launched two warships and constructing three more. Arnala and Andhroth, the first and second ships of this project, were launched on 20th December 2022 and on 21st March 2023, respectively. On 13th June 2023, GREC has launched third ship of anti-submarine warfare shallow watercraft called Anjadeep. The keel for 7th ship has also been laid. The anti-submarine warfare shallow watercraft is equipped with sophisticated sonar equipment including a hull-mounted sonar and towed low-frequency variable depth sonar for detecting and intercepting hostile submarines. These vessels are not only capable of detecting submarines but can also detect mines laid by submarines and midget submarines. In addition, it has capability to interdict and destroy subsurface targets in coastal waters. These ships can also perform search and rescue operations during both day and night in coastal areas and defend intruding aircraft and lay mines on the seabed. Each vessel has a displacement of around 750 tons, length of 77.6 meter and width of 10.5 meter. The vessel will have a maximum speed of 25 knots and a range of 1800 nautical miles at 14 knot speed. The vessel will be armed with one RBO 6000 anti submarine rocket launcher, six lightweight anti submarine warfare torpedo, and anti submarine mines launched from mine laying rails. It also features a 30 mm naval gun and two 12.7 mm M2 stabilized remote control gun. Sansodak, the fourth of four ships of survey vessel Large, that is SVL project, being built by LNT and GRSC for Indian Navy, was launched on 13th June 2023 at Katupalli, Chennai. The contract for building four SVL ships was signed between Ministry of Defense and GRSC Kolkata on 30th October 2018. As per the build strategy, the first ship was to be built by GRC Kolkata and construction of remaining three ships up to outfitting stage has been subcontracted to LNT Shipbuilding Katupalli. The first three ships of this project, which are Sandhyak, Nirdeshak and Ikshak, was launched on 5th December 2021, 26 May 2022 and 26 November 2022 respectively. The SVL ships will replace existing Sandhya class of survey ships with new generation hydrographic equipment to collect the oceanographic data. The hull of these ships is made from indigenously developed DMR-249A steel manufactured by Steel Authority of India Limited. The survey vessel is a signing example of Make in India with 80% indigenous content by cost. The vessels are equipped with highly advanced state-of-art hydrographic equipments and sensors including a halo hangar to accommodate one advanced light helicopter. With the capability to carry four survey motorboats and an integral helicopter, these ships can undertake full-scale coastal and deep water hydrographic surveys of ports and navigational channels. This helps in mapping and determination of the navigational channels or routes. In addition, the vessels can undertake survey of maritime limits up to exclusive economic zone. These vessels are deployed for collection of oceanographic and geophysical data for defense application. The data provided by these vessels helps Indian Navy to operate their warship and especially submarines deep inside the blue waters. The reason why China keeps sending its survey and dual-purpose spy vessels 
in Indian Ocean region is to collect these hydrographic information to be able to effectively operate its submarines. These modern, indigenously developed 110 meter long and 16 meters wide vessels have a displacement of nearly 3,400 tons and can attain a top speed of 18 knots with an endurance of 6,500 nautical miles. The ship can be fitted with a CRM-91 naval gun. The close-range Naval-91 is a naval version of Maydak 30mm automatic gun. With a range of 4 km, the gun has a rate of fire of nearly 200 to 300 rounds per minute. This was today's update. Please let us know your views on this in comment section. If you like the video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind. We'll be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.